Travis, marketing for Polygon is gonna tell us all about it. What we got here, Travis? Yeah, we've got the all new Siskiyou TLER. It's Polygon's new SL trail bike. It's gonna be coming out later this, uh, this August. Uh, it comes equipped with a Bosch Performance SX motor that's gonna have 55 Newton meters of torque. That's gonna be paired with a 400 watt hour battery and it's gonna come standard equipped with a 250 watt hour boost extender, which is gonna go right there underneath the bottle. Uh, on top of that, you're gonna have a Fox 36 Performance Elite uh, suspension in the front with 150 millimeters of travel and uh, Fox suspension in the rear as well with 140 uh, right. travel. So the key, key detail here is they are gonna be using the Bosch Performance Line SX motor. I've tried all the mid-powered bikes. The Fatsua is the best right now, but it doesn't have an extender. This motor has an extender available today and it has uh, not only 400 watts like the Patsuo, but they're claiming 600 watts, yeah, right? Exactly. Why did you choose this motor? Yeah, uh, so Bosch obviously has a great reputation. Um, and on top of that, it's a very lightweight motor that has a great uptick, so it moves when you need it to go. Um, all in all, this bike's gonna come in at 41 pounds. 41 pounds. The other company that has a bike is Norco. I think it got released last week. Completely sold out. It's gone, so you can't get it. <laughs> and so that, that's what got me excited, is they're gonna come out with this bike. People want it, but there's no bikes. And the Norco was like 12 grand that I tested. So what is your price point gonna be? Hopefully it's a little more affordable than 12. Yeah, it's it's definitely gonna come in well under that $12,000 mark. Uh, so expect the um, the typical, very consumer friendly, family oriented Polygon pricing that you see across the, our uh, range of bikes. Um, I can't release the exact price so not yet. yet huh? uh -huh. uh, yeah, look forward more towards uh, July for uh, information on pricing. Um, I can tell you that this is going to be one of two model specs available. This will be the higher model spec. It's the higher end? Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so you're going to get SRAM XX Eagle Type T transmission. Transmission! Yeah, with Axis group set. Um, the the uh, lower spec model is still going to have SRAM XX. You're, or sorry, SRAM Axis. You're going to get a GX group set with that and GX. a really awesome Marzocchi suspension to go alongside yeah, yeah. it. And that's key. Oh, we even have Magura brakes. Yep. So with, with e-bikes, it's so essential uh, to have the good suspension and the brakes. But one thing I noted uh, in my video yesterday when I tested this motor, is this motor, you need SRAM transmission. Because unlike other e-bikes where you don't shift, you gotta shift uh, with this motor while you're pedaling to keep your cadence up. There you go. Yep. Any other uh, comments that our viewers uh, should know about this, uh, this bike and the, and the Polygon brand? Yeah, um, it, yeah, I think you covered it pretty well. Um, the Magura brakes obviously have great stopping power, uh, so you're gonna pair that with the high performance transmission and it's really gonna do whatever you need it to do. It's gonna be great uh, out climbing fire trails as well as descending on some chunky rock gardens. It's really gonna be able to handle pretty much anything you throw at it, just like the analog mechanical Siski range. Right, so can't wait till August. They'll, you get, they guys, ha they have it, but hopefully they can send me one beforehand so I can give you the, the honest trail scoop on Yeah, it. let's do it.